Praise the living God. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Glory, 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 hallelujah to the Lamb of God. This is the day that the Lord has made. You and now we will rejoice and be glad in it. In the name of Jesus Christ, we bless the name of the Lord. He's worthy, he's mighty, he's excellent, he's wonderful. Mighty Jehovah, excellent Jehovah, wonderful Jehovah. We bless the name of the Lord for waking you and I up to see another day, to see another blessing for day. We thank God for God. We bless his holy name in Jesus' name, his word. He's mighty, he's excellent, he's wonderful. We bless the name of the Lord. There's many people that went to bed last night, with beloved. They are not alive anymore. We thank God for, for you and I. We thank God for our family for waking us up to see another blessing for day. We are grateful to Almighty God. He's so good. He's so kind. Our lovely daddy, our lovely sweet daddy, the heaven, the God of heaven and earth, the creator of heaven and earth, the possessor of heaven and earth. We bless his holy name. He's worthy. He's worthy. He's worthy. We are proud of our Lord Jesus. He's worthy. We bless his holy name in Jesus' name. May the Lord bless you all. May the Lord bless you all. May the Lord bless you all in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Hallelujah, hallelujah to the Lamb of God in Jesus' name. Amen. I would like to have a word of prayer. May the Lord bless you. Oh, Heavenly Father, the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, the ancient so dear, Father, you are beautiful. You are excellent. You are wonderful, Father, awesome that you are. Father, thank you, everlasting Father, for your bringing us again, Almighty God. Father, mighty God, to sit at your feet, Almighty God, we thank you for another beautiful day. We thank you for your divine protection. We thank you, Lord. Thank you, never leave us, nor forsake us, O Lord. We thank you for your for your mighty hand that rests upon us, O Lord. Father, we thank you for your grace. We thank you for your compassion. We thank you for your mercy towards us, O Lord. We appreciate you, Lord. Also, that you are marvelous, that you are great, that you are. And Almighty God, in any way that I'm sinned against you, Father, I plead for your mercy. In any way that we are sinned against you, I plead for your mercy. Father, wash us, Father, cleanse us, Father, purify us in your precious blood. In the name of Jesus Christ, Father God, I cover myself, I cover each and every one of us with the precious blood of Jesus Christ. We plead the blood of Jesus Christ on the air, on the land, on the sea, under the sea. We plead the blood of Jesus Christ on the on the first heaven, on the second heavens. We plead the blood of Jesus Christ. We plead the blood of Jesus Christ, we plead the blood of Jesus Christ in the east, in the west, in the north, in the south. Right now, in the name of Jesus Christ, Father God, we thank you. For the precious blood of the Lamb of God, Holy Spirit of God, we welcome in our midst and come and have your way. Holy Spirit of God, I decree you increase in me. Holy Spirit of God, have my mouth and use it for your glory. Holy Spirit of God, anoint my mouth, fresh, anoint my voice afresh uh, with your fresh anointing. Anoint my lips in the name of Jesus Christ, Holy Spirit of God. I decree you increase in me, Holy Spirit of God. I have not you on my own, everything belongs to you. The ministry belongs to your hand over out hand over the ministry unto your hand unto your pants holy spirit of god holy spirit of god come and hear all your sons and your daughter that sick right now as today program is jesus christ is oh lord hear your children father hear your children in the name of jesus christ there is nothing i have for you to do my regard oh lord let your healing reign Shall one upon your children, on your sons and your daughter today, Father. When I use the blood of Jesus, I claim their healing for them in the name of Jesus Christ. Oh Lord, my Father, thank you, Lord. Everlasting Father, mighty God, any power, any spirit, any personality that want to attack, oh Father, let your tongue of fire rise and consume them. And I build the head of fire around your beauty, you can't your fire around your, your sons and your daughter, Lord. But you are the God that hands started by fire. But we love you, we for we do. We love you, you are the God Almighty God, the consuming fire. You hands out your rose by fire. Oh Lord. Oh, my Father, you are the consuming fire. Father, we give you all the glory, all the honor, and the praise. Oh, Lord, as the everlasting Father. Come and have your way, Daddy. In Jesus' mighty name, I have prayed. Amen and amen. Praise, Master Jesus. Hallelujah. To the Lamb of God, we bless the name of the Lord. His word. His word of our praise. His word of our worship. His word of our Lord. His word of our magnify. Our Lord is worthy. Our God is good. My fellow Jehovah, great Jehovah, we thank God for God. We bless his holy name, his word. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Amen. I would like to sing to the glory of God. Please, if you know the song, John, John, me, let us bless that. the name of the Lord. Let us worship him. Let us adore him. He is worthy. He is mighty of our praise, of our worship. We, 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 we bless his holy name. We will worship him in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I give you all the glory. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. 
I give you all the honor. Oh, I give you all the glory. I give you all the honor. I give you all the glory, Lord. I give you all the honor, Lord. Oh, I give you all the glory. I give you all the honor. Heavenly Father, we give you all the glory, Lord. We give you all the honor. Oh, we give you all the glory. We give you all the honor. We give you all the glory, Lord. We give you all the honor. Oh, we give you all the glory. We give you all the honor. We give you all the glory, Lord. We give you all the honor. Oh, we give you all the glory. We give you all the honor. We give you all the glory, Lord. We give you all the honor. Oh, we give you all the glory. We give you all the honor. We give you all the glory, Lord. We give you all the honor, Lord. Oh, we give you all the glory. We give you all the honor. We give you all the glory, Lord. We give you all the honor. Oh, we give you all the glory. We give you all the honor. We give you all the glory, Lord. We give you all the honor. Oh, we give you all the glory. We give you all the honor. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Amen. Amen. Give me oil, my lamb. Give me pony. Yes, Lord. Give me oil, my lamb. I pray. Give me oil, my lamb. Give me money, Lord. Give me money to the day of day. Give me oil, my lamb. Give me money, Lord. Give me oil, my lamb, I pray, Lord. Give me oil, my lamb, keep me bonny, Lord. Give me bonny to the grace of day. Oh, give me honey, my lamb, keep me bonny, Lord. Oh, Papa, God, give me honey, my lamb, I pray. Give me honey, my lamb, keep me bonny, Lord. Give me bonny to the grace of day. Oh, give me on in my line, keep me bonny, Lord. Oh, give me on in my line, I pray, Lord. Give me on in my line, keep me bonny, Lord. Give me bonny to the great of day. Oh, give me on in my line, keep me bonny. Give me on in my line, I pray, Lord. Give me on in my line, keep me money. Give me money to the great of day. Oh, see, Gosanna, see, Gosanna, see, Gosanna to the great of the great. See, Gosanna, see, Gosanna, see, Gosanna to the great of day. Give me honey, my line, give me bonny, Lord. Give me honey, my line, I pray, Lord. Give me honey, my line, keep me bonny, Lord. Give me bonny to the great so day. Amen. Father God, keep give us. Keep our land, continue giving us your all year from above, Almighty God, for our land, spiritual land, continue to be born in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen and amen and amen. Oh, hallelujah to the Lamb of God. We bless the name of the Lord. We bless the name of the Lord. He's worthy. He's mighty. He's excellent. He's wonderful. Beloved, 
May the Lord bless you all. May the Lord bless you. I welcome you all in the name of Jesus. For all my, all my beloved sisters, my beloved brother, my beloved sisters and brother, my mommies, my daddies. I welcome you all and once again. I welcome you. May the Lord bless you all in Jesus' name. Amen. We bless the name of the Lord. He's worthy. He's mighty. He's excellent. He's wonderful. For today's program, Jesus Christ, He is your Lord, my Lord, the maker of heaven and earth. Everlasting Savior, He is. Compassionate God, He is. He wants to hear you. My mommies, my daddies, my brothers, my sisters, wherever you are in the hospital at home, you are sick. Believe, Almighty God. Believe that Jesus Christ is there where you are right now. He's there. He just wants you to believe He is a healer. He just wants you to believe. Release your faith. Even though your faith is very, is tiny, is very small. Believe he will hear you. Praise Master Jesus. Believe he will hear you. Maybe within you, the enemy will be lying to you. Maybe this sickness will take your life. Then maybe you will not own it. You will not survive this sickness or all this thing. Please don't believe the enemy. The enemy is a liar. God will hear you. You will live to your full age in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. You will live, not die, but live. You will live to, to glorify Almighty God for the glory of God in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you wherever you are. I would like to read the word of the Lord to encourage you. Our Master Jesus, that he 2,000 years ago, he see the same Jesus, he see healing. He see he doing the same business. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. He still doing the same business. Our Master Jesus, the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, the ancients of days, the everlasting Father, everlasting Savior, everlasting Redeemer. He wants to hear you. He wants to hear you. He loves to hear you. All you have to do, believe in him. Trust in him. All that uh, he hid, the time he was on this earth, all that were he by him, all of them, they trust in him. They have, they, have, they have faith that Jesus can hear them. He hid the blind. He opened the blind eyes. He raised the dead. <clears throat> he hid the sick ones. He cast, them, he cast out the demons. Foul spirit, he cast them out from people. He healed many people. Our compassionate God, is a, he is a compassionate father. Compassionate father that, that sees you going through that pain every time, crying, it touches him. He wants you to release your faith. He wants you to release your faith. He's there to hear you. He's just asking you, my son, my daughter, please don't doubt. My son, my daughter, don't doubt. I am the healer. My son, my daughter, don't doubt. I am the one that sent my daughter to come and pray for you. Just believe it. You will receive your healing. <coughs> Praise Master Jesus. Praise Master Jesus. Maybe the daughter... They have given up on you because they have been giving you medicine, trying some of them, even that even even many of them even they cannot even prescribe what they, they cannot even tell you what is going on. They cannot find anything that is going on. But, but within you, you are passing through, through that pain. You know you are sick, you know, but they cannot find nothing out. Jesus is here that knows everything. Just Jesus that Christ you wants you to believe in him. He is the healer. He will heal you. Master Jesus wants to heal you. Everlasting Jesus wants to heal you. He sent me to come and pray for you. I will use the word of the Lord. We read the word of the Lord to encourage you. He that he 2,000 years ago is still the same Jesus. He still delivering, he still saving, he still healing. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. 
Praise Master Jesus. I would like to, 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 to read the word of the Lord to encourage you. Before I will pray for you, let me read the word of the Lord to encourage you. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Amen. The book of John chapter 11, verse 3 to 4. Verse 3, verse 3 to 4, and verse 33 to 35, 38 to 44, the book of John. I want to read the word to encourage you, beloved. He that, he that does it for somebody out there, by them, is still the same Jesus. Is still, still the same Jesus doing the same business. Healing, healing his children, setting his children free from oppressing of the devil, casting out on the devil, foul, foul spirit, dumb and dead spirit, is still healing. Our Master Jesus is still healed. Master Jesus is still healed. Praise Master Jesus. I would like to read the word of the Lord to encourage you. The book of John chapter 11 verse 3 to 4. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. I read in Jesus' name. Therefore, his sister the son unto the him, saying, Lord, behold, he whom thou loveth is sick. When Jesus heard that, he said, This sickness is not unto death, but for the glory of a God. But that the son of a sorry that the son of a man might be glorified thereby. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. 30, 33, 33 to thirty-five. I read in Jesus' name. When Jesus therefore saw their heart weeping, and the Jews also there weeping, which came with their heart. He groaned in the spirit, and was troubled, and said, Where have ye laid him? Then I said unto him, Lord, come and see. Jesus wept. Hallelujah. From, praise Master Jesus. From 30, 38 to 44. Jesus therefore, Jesus, therefore, again groaning in himself, coming to the grave. It was a, it was a cave, and a stone laid upon it. Jesus said, Take ye away the stone matter, the sister of him that was there, death, said unto him, Lord, by the this time, he, he stink, he stinketh, for the he has, a, has a been a dead for four days. Jesus said unto her, sorry, Jesus, Jesus said unto her, said I not unto her, deep, that if thou wouldest and believe, does thou shouldest see the glory of God. Then the dead took away the stone from the place where the dead was laid. And Jesus lifted up his eyes and said, said Father, I thank thee that thou hast heard me. And I knew that thou heard me always. But because of the people, which a son by, I said it, that a day may not believe that a thou has sent me. And when he does had spoken, he cried with a loud voice, Lazarus, comfort. And he that was a death came forth, bound a hand and a foot, with a grave cross, and his face was a bound, a battle with a, a napping. Jesus said unto them, Lose him, and let him go. 
Praise Master Jesus. Beloved, we thank God for God. We thank God for Jesus. The sickness you are going through, they are passing through right now. That sickness. In the name of Jesus Christ, He will leave you. He will leave you. He will let you go. As, 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 as Father Lord Jesus Christ said, they should lose him and let him go. And they lose him and he went free. He was set free. He was set free when the sister came and sat and would tell to Jesus. Jesus said, Jesus said, don't worry, my, my, don't worry. This sickness is not unto death. Jesus is telling you, my brothers, my sister, my mommy, my daddy is the sick right in the hospital home. Jesus is telling you that this sickness is not, is not unto death. The sickness that you are passing through right now is not unto death. People might give up on you. The daughters might give up, give up on you. Don't worry. Jesus Christ is there to touch you. Jesus Christ is touch you. He is the master healer. Somebody that was dead the four days, a berry is thinking, now Lord Jesus brought life to that man. And he said, let the, as he told them, uh, lose him, let lose him. All those claims that, all those claims that the was because the, the, the grave clothes uh, must go. The grave clothes of a sickness and disease must leave you in the name of Jesus Christ. Every false spirit, every false spirit of sickness and disease uh, must leave you at the name of Jesus Christ. Every knee shall bow. Our Lord Jesus Christ said, My Father, Almighty God, has given him the name that is above our name. The name that is above our name, he has been given. Lord Jesus Christ said, My Father, Almighty God, has given, given him the name that is above our name. That sickness that you have, that sickness right now, he, he has a name, and that name is under the name of Jesus. The name of that disease, the name of that sickness under the feet of Jesus. All you have to do, you have to believe in him. Lord Jesus Christ was moved. Lord Jesus Christ was, 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 was grieved. Lord Jesus Christ was, was groaning in his spirit. Well, he was groaning in his spirit. How can my son, how can my brother, how can my, the one that I love, Come, put in the come, and now pass through this sickness, and this sickness taking his life. It can be. This man must live to, the, to his full age, and God gave him the grace to live it to his full age. He said to this thing, the sister, he said, "Don't you cry, don't you cry." People that cry, they said, "Don't you weep." Don't cry. This sickness, this death, this, 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 this sickness is not, it's not up to death. This man will come alive. Just believe. He's telling you, my brothers, my sisters, my mommy, my daddy is in the hospital at home. That's sick right now. Just believe. This your sin, that sickness is not up to death. All you have to do, believe. Because Jesus cried because of Lazarus. He's crying because of the situation you are going through right now. Because you couldn't, you cannot, you couldn't help yourself anymore. You want to do, you want like to, you you would like to do something, but you couldn't do something because of this sickness. You go to bed crying to cry because of the pain you cannot sleep. You turn it from right to left. You turn it. The pain is too much. You cannot sleep. You waking up, the little sleep you will sleep. You wake up, you see for yourself uh, in that pain. Mama said, Jesus wants to heal you. All you have to do, believe. He that heal the sick ones, he that, the, that said that the, the, the press of friends, he that cast on clean spirit out of the children, out of the children, the one, the time he was living here, he see the same Jesus. He wants to do the same for you. All you have to do, please don't doubt. Just believe in him, trust in him, have faith. All the one that has, all the one that do, the, 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 the one that he hid by them, all of them have faith. When he will hear them, they receive the ease of my daughter, my son, your father has made you whole. He wants you to release your faith wherever you are. Just release your faith and, and receive your healing. Don't let this healing pass you by. 
This healing, don't let it pass you by. This healing is not out to them. Don't let it pass you by. You shall not die, but live and declare the words of the Lord. You shall live to your full end. As he gave the Lazarus, Lazarus, as he gave Lazarus a grace to live to his full age, he woke him up. He called upon the sister, Lazarus, comfort. The dead couldn't hold the Lazarus. The grave couldn't keep, keep him there. He said, no, 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 we have to release him. Master Jesus, the owner of the body, the owner of the thing that the man is calling the man, we cannot keep him bound. We cannot keep him bound in this grave. This grave, this grave, you, can, you don't have any power over Lazarus. You must leave, you must let him go. As he heard the voice of Lazarus, comfort, and he came for the, the death could not be able to hold him. As you are here in the name of Jesus Christ, every demons of sickness and sickness, I command them to lose their hold over your life in Jesus' name. I command them to take their exit out of your life and God out of your life right now. In the name of Jesus, Christ. by the name of Jesus, Christ. by the name of the Lord Almighty, at the mention of the Lord Jesus Christ, amen. The things in the heaven, the things on this earth, under this earth shall bow and confess that Jesus Christ is Lord to the, to the glory of God the Father. As I command you, you sickness and diseases that trouble my sisters, my, 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 my brothers, that trouble my mommies and daddies, wherever you are, as I command you right Right now, in the name of Jesus, lose your hold, lose and let them go in Jesus' name. My sisters, my mommies, my daddies, and my, my brothers, I say in the name of Jesus, I say, come forth out of that sickness. Come forth in the name of Jesus. Come forth, no sickness can bond you. Come forth, no disease can bond you. Come forth, no infirmity can bond you. Come forth in Jesus' name. Hallelujah. Praise Master Jesus. In the name of Jesus Christ, I feel like God has given me the key. The key that comes against the authority. I burn every sickness and diseases. Wherever you, you are, you are hearing the sound of my voice. I said I burn you. I cast you out of that woman's house, out of that woman's house, out of that daughter's house of God's life, out of that daddy, the daughter of Zion. I burn you. I cast you out. Lose your hold. Lose your hold. Lose your grip out of their lives right now. In the name of Jesus Christ. As a grave, could you ever to burn to, to, to hold Lazarus? You, you that demons of sickness and disease, you cannot hold, you cannot hold that a daughter of God, that a son of God. You cannot hold them bound, never. Lose them and let them go now, right now, as you are hearing the sound of my voice in Jesus' name. I command you, lose them. Who the son of God set free straight in? They shall see the children of God, the daughters of the earth, they are hearing the sound of my voice. They shall be healed and they shall stand up and glorify the Lord and testify that Jesus has healed them. Devil, you cannot stop it. Who the son of God is free? Who the son of God set free is free? Jesus has set you free, my son, my, my brothers, my sisters. Jesus has set you free, my, 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 my beloved ones. Jesus has set you free wherever you are, in the hospital, in the, in the, at home. Jesus has set you free. Who the son of God set free is free indeed. As he told them, uh, matter. He said, matter, just believe. Matter, just believe. He's telling you right now, wherever you are, just believe. I said, Dad couldn't help. I said, Dad couldn't able to hold Lazarus for that four days in the grave. I don't know how many years you be you 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 be sick. I don't know how many days. I don't know how many weeks. But Jesus is Christ. Jesus Jesus Christ wants to heal you. As everyone was crying. Everyone was crying. The sister, the people that were there, they were crying. They were sobbing. They were crying because Lazarus has passed away. There was no hope for them anymore. Four days. Four days, no hope. When Master Jesus came, he said, don't worry. Don't worry, just believe. He's telling you, wherever you are, just believe. Just believe you will receive your miracle. Our God is a God of miracle. You will receive your miracle today, today. You will receive your miracle today, today. All you have to do, believe you will receive your miracle. He called upon it, Lazarus. Lazarus, comfort. And Lazarus came forth. He said, lose him. Lose him. This grave, this grave closed and lose him. 
and let him go. The grave couldn't be able to hold him. You see? That sickness will not hold you. That sickness, could, that sickness doesn't have the power to hold you. No! That sickness doesn't have power to hold you, to hold you down, to hold you down where you are right now. Enough is enough. This sickness has been a long time, has been a, a long time, maybe some days, some, some weeks, or some years, it is enough. And, they, and his days are over right now. By the authority of my Lord Jesus, I said that days are over in your life. That their days are over. Those sickness and diseases, all those spirit of false spirit and the, the death spirit, I command them. Your days are over. I said, death could be able to hold the son and Lazarus. You will not hold that son. You will not hold that daughter in sickness and disease. No. No. I speak healing not to every son, every daughter of God that hear in the sound of my voice. I speak healing in the name of Jesus. I speak healing unto you from the crown of your head to the sole of your feet. I speak healing. Receive your healing in the name of Jesus. Receive your healing. Really healing, ready, shower it. Where you are, just believe. Receive your healing. Grab it and hold on, hold on to your healing. In Jesus' name. When the Father Lord Jesus Christ called upon us, Lazarus, Lazarus, come forth. Lazarus didn't say, ah, no, I'm not coming forth. Lazarus didn't refuse that he will not come forth. Lazarus came forth. Wherever you are, my sisters, my brothers, I said, don't refuse. Don't refuse to receive your healing. Don't refuse to stand up and do what you couldn't do before. What you couldn't do before. Stand up and do it. You are healed in the name of Jesus Christ. You are healed. Stand up in the name of Jesus Christ. No, no, no sickness. I did not, no sickness that did it can, hide you, can hold you bound anymore. You are free. Jesus set you free. Amen. Amen. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. He sent me to come and pray for you. All you have to do, just believe. I said, we pray for you. Receive your healing and stand up and do what you couldn't do before. For days, for years, for months. What you couldn't do before, stand up and do it. All the glory belongs to God. I said, Father Lord Jesus Christ said, he said to him, he said to, he said to her, he said, this sickness is not up to that. Sister Martha, this sickness is not up to that. Sister Martha, this sickness is not to, is, is for the glory of God. This sickness is not up to that. This sickness is for, is for the glory of God, Sister Martha. He's telling you wherever you are, my mom is my dad is my sister's my brother. He's telling you that and right now, he's telling you that sickness that you're passing through, that you have is not up to dead. It's a glibly glory to God. That people that saw you see for many days, weeks, months, years, they will glorify God. They say yes. Master Jesus have visited her. Master Jesus have visited visit him. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. The sickness is not on today. It's to bring glory to God. It's to bring glory to God. It's to bring glory. Just believe in your heart. Just believe in your heart. Jesus a cried with a loud voice. Lazarus, come forth. And he came forth. Praise Master Jesus. When he called the dead, no power that can hold them. Not a evil dead is ever. No power can hold you down anymore in Jesus' name. No power, sickness, and diseases can hold you down. No power, no infirmity. The infirmities can hold you bound anymore. Hold you anymore. No, no, no. As the grave. The grave couldn't be able to hold that uh, 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 brother Lazarus. Same. <laughs> we, 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 we thank God. We bless the name of the Lord. We thank God for, for, for his goodness. Praise Master Jesus. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Hallelujah. God's a power. Alone can bring a life and the dead. He's the God Almighty that has the power. 
He's a God Almighty that has the power to, to bind and to lose. No other power. He's a God Almighty that has the power to do what he said he wants to do. Nobody can change it, but the enemy don't have, doesn't have that power. When God, when he when he planned his plan, Father God intervened and said, you don't touch my daughter. It is time for you to lose her. It is time for you to lose and you this sickness and that. They cannot say no. They must obey. At the name of Jesus Christ, things in the heaven, things on this earth, under this earth, must bow and confess that Jesus Christ is Lord to the glory of God the Father. Lord Jesus, Father God, I've given him the name that is above all names. Praise Master Jesus. Praise Master Jesus. As I will pray for you, just believe. Believe and receive your healing. This healing will not pass you by. My mommies, my daddies, my sisters, my brothers. This healing will not pass you by. In Jesus' name. You will testify to the glory of God. You will testify to the glory of God. In the name of Jesus Christ. I would like to, 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 to sing to the glory of God after a few singing. I will pray for you. Before I start singing, as I'm singing, receive your healing. Because as I'm singing, the rain of blessing, the rain of healing is showering. All you have to do as I'm singing right now, just, be, just open your heart, believe, and receive your healing. In Jesus' name, amen. It is well. Amen. It is well. It is well. It is well. With my soul, with my soul. Oh, it is one, it is one with my soul. It is one, it is one with my soul, with my soul. Oh, it is one, it is one with my soul. It is why it is one with my soul, with my soul. Oh, it is one, it is one with my soul. It is why it is one with your soul, with your soul. Oh, it is one, it is one with. It is why it is one with your soul, with your soul. Oh, it is one, it is one with my soul. It is why it is one with your soul, with your soul. Oh, it is one, it is one with your soul. It is one, it is one with your soul, with your soul. I say it is one, it is one with your soul. It is one, it is one. With your soul, with your soul. I said it's this way, it is this way. With your soul. It is way, it is way. Receive your healing. It is way, it is way. Oh, it is way. It is way. With your soul. It is way, it is way. With my soul, with my soul. Oh, it is one. It is one. With my soul. It is one. It is one. Oh, with your soul, with your soul. I, uh, I say it is one. It is one. It is one. It is one. With your soul. Praise Master Jesus, hallelujah to the name of God. Hallelujah. 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 Ah. Uh... 
Thank you, Jesus. 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 The Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit of God, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit of God, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, Holy Spirit. Jesus Christ. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. We bless the name of the Lord. His word, His word, His word. We thank God for His God. We thank God. We bless His holy name in Jesus' name. My sisters, my brothers, my mommies, my daddies, your healing God, I've given you your healing. You have healed in Jesus' name. Amen. You are healed in Jesus' name. Amen. Please, I want to ask you, please, if you have any, any any bitterness in your heart. If you have any bitterness in your heart, please. I want you to release. I want you to let that bitterness go. Jesus, our healer, is a God Almighty. As he said to, you, to us in his word, he says, If you and I don't forgive the one that hurt us, that sinned against us, that hurt us, Father God will not forgive us. Please don't let this healing pass you by because of unforgiveness. Please don't let this healing pass you by because of unforgiveness. Please forgive anyone that have ever hurt you. Please, if I'm telling you that if somebody hurts you, it's not painful, I'm not telling you that, that the truth, I'm lying to you. Please, it hurts. When somebody, that, there's somebody that you love, somebody that you, that you trust betrayed you, it hurts. 
Please forgive. Let that bitterness go. Let it go. The enemy wants to use that, that bitterness to steal the blessing of God from you. The enemy knows when you are bitter, when you are bitter, you cannot receive from God. Because God said, if you don't forgive, he will not forgive you. That means when you are asking something, when you hold somebody in your mind, you are asking something, God is telling you, if you don't forgive that person, I will not forgive you. Please, God wants to hear you. All you have to do, please, forgive that person and receive from Almighty God the healing that he wants, he wants to give you right now. Please forgive. No matter what they have done to you, it might be your sister, it might be your brother, it might be your husband or your wife. It might be the husband, the, the husband left you or your wife left you. All your children don't even care for you. They don't even know where you live. They don't even know if they have their parents. It's hurting you when you remember what you have done, how you trained them up, how you suffered. At times you, you cannot, at times you couldn't eat because of them you just want to have something to put in there on the table for them just to feed them even though you don't have anything to eat you are fine but now some of them don't even know where you where, where if, if whether if you are alive or you are not alive anymore i'm talking to mommies and daddies wherever you are please forgive that your son forgive that your daughter forgive them god will reward you God will reward you greatly. God will tell that your son, he will tell that your daughter. The moment you forgive them and pray, start praying for them. God will tell them. God will put your love into their heart to remember their parents and come and say, Father, Mommy, I'm sorry for what I have done to hurt you, for what I have done this year, for neglecting you, for abandoning you, not even, believe, not even one day say, let me call you, say, Mommy, how are you? Daddy, how are you? I know it hurts. Please forgive. Please, it might be your friend that betrayed you. Please forgive. Lord Jesus Christ, forgive. He forgave all oh, what we have done to hurt him. When uh, uh, Judah, he, uh, his, uh, his character betrayed Father Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus still called him friend. He knows that he is the one that betrayed him. When he was coming to give him a key, his case of betraying, 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 Lord Jesus Christ still called him friend. My friend, where are you coming from? You see? May the Lord give you that grace. May the Lord give all of us the grace of forgiving. That's forgiving spirit that you will see our enemies. We will forgive them and call their friend. Pray for them. And God will forgive you. God will hear you. Please, he wants to hear you. He wants you to receive your healing right now. He wants you to receive your healing right now. Please, don't doubt. Master Jesus is there. Forgive anyone that has hurt you. Please forgive them. It doesn't work for you. Suffering all this, this sickness, uh, suffer pain every time because of what they have done to you. That person that did what he did, that person enjoying their lives out there. Or maybe some of them have passed away, but you are still going through that pain. Please release them from your mind. Let it go so you enjoy your life. You enjoy your healing. You receive your healing right now. You enjoy your healing to your full age before God will call you home in Jesus' name. Please release them. Don't hold off forgiveness. Forgive them. Forgive them. Forgive them. I know it's painful. God will give you the grace to forgive them. Release them from your heart. Release them. Let them go. Let them go. It's not worth for you to be to be to be to be sick and uh, because of you remember what they did to you. You cannot grieve all the your bones, Steve, or everything, Steve in your body causing sickness and diseases. Please forgive them. Believer. Believers and the unbelievers, all of us, we need forgiveness. All of us, we have to give uh, forgiveness to others. One way and another, we hurt somebody. And God, give them the grace to forgive us. Please let us forgive. Receive your healing. As I will pray.
believe God has healed you. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. Amen. Please forgive. 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 Because as, you, as Father God said in his word, is, his word is yes and amen. Mighty chapter 6 verse 15. If you don't forgive, my heavenly Father will not forgive you. He said it very plainly. Please forgive. Please forgive. May the Lord bless you for forgiving. May the Lord bless you for releasing that woman, for releasing that man, that, 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 that person that hurt you. God bless you for releasing them out of your mouth, for your letting them go, for your open your mouth say, right now. Say, Father God, I have forgiven them. Thank you for forgiving them. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you. May the, may the Lord increase more grace of forgiving. Forgive your spirit unto you. More grace for may the Lord give you more grace to be continue forgiving as from today onward. Forgive, 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 forgive. You see, you start living in good health, long life, longevity. It's yours in Jesus' name. I thank God for you. Thank God for forgiving them. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you. Your healing shall remain. In Jesus' name, amen, amen. I'm happy, I'm happy that you forgive those uh, that hurt you, that fill you up. I'm happy. May the Lord bless you in Jesus' name, amen. Okay, let us pray. Heavenly Father, the King of kings, the Lord of all the nations of this. Father God, I thank you for the grace, Almighty God, that you have given to that your son, daughters, and that your son, daughters, that your sons. Heavenly Father, I thank you for the grace that you that you have given to them to release the one that hurt them. Thank you for healing them right now in the name of Jesus. I thank you for that spirit of forgiving spirit that you have blessed them with right now in the name of Jesus. Christ. Father God, I thank you. Father God, I bless you. Father God, I worship you. Father God, I adore you. And I bring all your sons and your daughters to you right now in the hospital at home, wherever they are. They are sick right now, Father. And you are our healer. Father, they release their faith. Father, you say, even though we have a, a, a faith that, that is like a mustard seed, if we say to this mountain, this mountain be that remote, this mountain be that cast to say, into the sea shall be. Father, Almighty God, in the name of Jesus Christ, Father God, heal your soul, so your daughter, and let your healing ray shower far, your healing ray from the throne room, Almighty God, flow right now and shower upon them right now in the name of Jesus Christ, Father, let your rain of healing shower upon them right now in the name of Jesus Christ, let your mighty hand of healing rest upon them right now in the name of Jesus Father, wash every sickness and diseases out of their land to their life from the crown of their head to the soul of their feet in the name of Jesus Christ, Father, any kind of sickness they are sick right now, I fully, Father, every name is under the name of my and our Lord Jesus Christ, that sickness name is under the name of Jesus, it's under the feet of Jesus. Oh Lord, my Father, my Lord, touch your children. Oh Lord, my Father, oh Lord, my God, raise your children up out of that sickness and disease of my God. As you said, according to your word, this sickness is not, it's not unto them. That sickness is not unto them. That sickness is to bring glory to you, Almighty God. Their sickness is to bring us right now today. You have given them the healing right now, Father God. Now they will stand up, they will glorify your holy name, they will testify you have healed them. If you did this sickness, I bring glory to you, Almighty God. Oh Lord, my Father, come now heal it. And I continue on the anointing, the fresh anointing that destroyed the yoke. Every joke of sickness and sickness, Father, let your fresh anointing from above and anoint your children and break those jokes out of their lives. Out of their lives, right now, the from the crown of their head to the soul of their feet. Let that joke be broken in the name of that joke of sickness and sickness be broken in the name of Jesus. Now, my Father, as you are giving me the power, the authority to bond on those, I come against in the name of Jesus. Now, every spirit of sickness and disease is Against the, against the children of God's life right now in the hospital home. I say in the name of Jesus, I command you in the name of Jesus, leave them right now. Lose your hold and leave them in the name of Jesus. Lose your grip and lose your hold out of their lives in the name of Jesus. It is written. That body is a temple of the Holy Ghost. You cannot dread it. I say in the name of Jesus, I use sickness and disease. Hear the sound of my voice. You cannot rest. You cannot stay in the children of God's life. You cannot stay in their body because their body belongs to Jesus. My body is a temple of the Holy Ghost. Pack your bag and baggage and leave right now. Go back to the abyss. And remain bound in the name of Jesus. You first spirit, I bound you and I cast you out. I say, You both first spirit, I bound you and I cast you out. I bound you and I cast you out. I bound you and I cast you out. Back to the abyss and remain bound in the name of Jesus. Never rise up anymore to the dead. The judgment day of the Lord in the name of Jesus. The children of God shall be healed. The children of God shall be healed from the crown of their head to the soul of their feet in the name of Jesus. As we heal in the children of God. As we healing unto their mind, uh, as we heal unto their eyes, unto their ears, uh, as we healing unto their mouth, to their heart, uh, as we heal unto their kidneys, uh, as we heal unto their unto, unto their intestines, uh, intestines uh, as we heal unto their morals, uh, as we heal unto that unto their veins, uh, as we heal unto their tissues, uh, as we heal.
Billion to the children of God right now, wherever they are. I say, children of God, daughters of God, the sons of God, receive your healing energy. I say, receive your healing. In the name of Jesus Christ, receive your healing. In the name of Jesus Christ, receive your healing. In the name of Jesus Christ, this sickness cannot bound you anymore. I come against those sickness and spirit, the disease of those spirits of sickness and disease are bound you. And I cast you under the children of God and take your exit out of their lives. In the name of Jesus Christ, I soak the children of God right now in the precious blood of Jesus Christ. So them in the blood of children from the crown of their head. To the soul of their feet, uh, I saw them in the picture of blood of the Lamb of God. Uh, in the name of Jesus, man, uh, who the Son of God self restrained uh, My sisters, my brothers, my mommy, my dears, and my daddies, uh, rejoice in the Lord. Uh, stand up and glorify the God. Uh, do what you couldn't be able to do for before. Do it, rejoice in the Lord. Uh, you are healing the name of Jesus, man. Uh, you are healing the name of Jesus, man. Uh, you are healing the name of Jesus, man. Uh, receive your healing. In the name of Jesus, man. Uh, receive your healing. In the name of Jesus, man. Uh, receive your healing. Receive your healing. Receive your healing. As you are here. The sound of my voice, receive your healing, receive your healing, receive your healing, receive your healing right now in the name of Jesus Christ. I see your healing with the precious blood of the Lamb of God. So shall it be in Jesus' name. You will stand up and glorify and testify the goodness of God to the glory of God in the name of Jesus Christ, my Father, my Lord. I thank you for your healing, your soul, so your daughter. I thank you for the healing, the Almighty God that wash, that flushes sickness and diseases out of your children's I thank you for your bonding, every father, every, every false spirit. Every powerful spirit, you burn them and cast them out of your children's side. But I'm gonna thank you, love every arrows of infirmity. You are put it out of your children's side. They can't, they, you let them cast fire and burn to ashes in the name of Jesus Christ. All powers belong to you in the name of Jesus Christ. Papa, my Lord, my Savior, my Redeemer, Father, you said, Talk no man, not touch, I do my prophet no harm. But I know, no, you said, The rod of the wicked shall not rest upon the righteous. The rod of the wicked, the rod of the wicked shall not rest upon me. I am a righteous child of God in Christ Jesus. Oh, Ramamache, Father. Father, my Lord, I give you all the glory, all the honor, the praise in the name of Jesus Christ, Father. Father, in the name of Jesus, any power, any spirit, any personality that want to attack me spiritually, spirit, physically, Father, let your thunder fire arise and consume them in the name of Jesus, wherever they are, in the east, in the west, in the north, in the south, in the first heaven, in the second heaven, sir, on this land, on the land, on the, on the sea, under the sea. Heavenly Father, let your thunder fire arise and consume them in the name of Jesus Christ. Oh Lord, my Father, thank you, Lord. Thank you for your healing, your son, so your daughter. Thank you for your divine healing. You are the healer. Father, take all the glory. Father, take all the honor. Father, take all the praise. Father, in Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. May the Lord bless you all. May the Lord bless you all. I am happy for you, my sisters, my brothers, my mommies, my daddies. May the Lord bless you. And I thank God for your life. I'm really grateful. I thank God for healing you. I thank God that Almighty God is our healer. We thank God your healing. Remain the same in that your real healing. Remain. Remain to you. You will, you will enjoy your your healing to your full age in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen and amen. Hallelujah. I am happy for you in Jesus' name. Amen. My brothers, my sisters, wherever you are, my mommies, my daddies, wherever you are, please, I thank God that God heed you. I'm really grateful to my almighty God. Please, I want to tell you, the God that, the God that heed you, he's still the same God. He wants to save your soul. He, still want, he wants to save your soul because he's coming soon. Lord Jesus Christ is coming soon. Please, if you don't have Jesus Christ as your Lord, you haven't accept him as your Lord, your Savior, you haven't given your life to him, you haven't made up your mind to be his child, please, I want you to do so today. Wherever you are, please do so. Give him your life because one day we will finish in the, on this earth and go back to where we come from by the grace of God. He gave you choice. He gave me choice. So you and I must choose Decide where we will spend our eternity. The time you and I came to this earth, the time God Almighty sent you and I to this earth, you and I, we didn't have any choice. We didn't have any choice. We didn't choose where we will be born to. The family we will be born to. We didn't choose our father, our mother. No. God sent us. This is where I sent you here. This family you will be born to. We bless the name of He know why he did it. He is a, he's God. We cannot question him. We bless the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. But the second born, the, the word of the Lord says, you and I must be born again. So the second born, you and I must choose where we, we, where we will spend eternity. Beloved, please, wherever you are, I want to, remember, I want to remind you that there is heaven, there is hell fire. It's because of that you are now 
we have to choose which which one are we going to 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 go when we finish on this end it is my prayer it is almighty god wish and his prayer for you and i to choose heaven to spend eternity with him when we finish on this earth for him to see also for him to open the pearly gate for you and i to say my daughter and my son come into my glory come i enjoy what i prepare for you the mansions the mansion that he, that the mansions that he prepared for us so we will enjoy it please i want you to give your life to jesus please don't choose a hair fire by you to by somebody choosing hair fire is by rejecting jesus by somebody choosing hair fire is by rejecting jesus please don't reject him he loves you so much he loves you so much he wants you to spend eternity with him he left in heaven he came to this earth to die for you and i so that you and i we will make it we will spend eternity with him when you finish on this earth he cherishes you so much. You are unique to him. He loves you. Don't let the enemy don't let the enemy lie to you. Say maybe one thing happen, one thing bad thing happen to you one 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 certain time. Because of that one, the enemy lied to you. Had it be God loves you? Why this bad thing will happen to you? Why this one do this to you? Why this one do this to you? If God is alive, please don't say don't let the enemy. The enemy is the one that caused that thing to happen to you. Why he wants you to he wants to take that thing, take you away from God. But I thank God for God that God wants to tell you that He wants to glorify Himself in your life. He wants to glorify, He loves you. No matter what have happened, he was is he is there with you. You are alive. You are alive. Hundred percent. You are alive. He gave he gave you life. You are alive. He gave you bread and the gift of life. We have all the reason to thank him. We have all the reason to give our life to him. He's coming back again. He told you and I. He told you in, in, in this word. He said he's coming back to take all his children home. He wants you to be one of his child. When he comes back, he will take you and all his children back home heaven please he doesn't want you to go and spend your eternity in hell fire may the lord bless you servant of god may the lord bless you so he doesn't want you he doesn't want you to go and spend eternity with your enemy no he doesn't want it he wants you he wants you to come and spend eternity with him he loves you so much if you can see in the eyes of jesus you will be if you will be so so you will be so joyful you'll be so happy to immediately you say yes lord yes lord he has good thing for you. He, he prepared heaven. He prepared your mansion for you. Please don't miss it. Have fire is not a place for you and I to go. He knew that the terrible in the terrible thing that going on in the hell fire is because of that. He said, no, my sons, my daughter, you cannot bear this. Let me come and pay the price for you. Please give him your life. He loves you. No, Jesus Christ loves you. He loves you so dearly. Please give him your life. Don't let the enemy deceive you. Don't let the enemy lie to you that he didn't he, he didn't he didn't love you had he been he love you all these things all those past things that happened could have not happened don't let the enemy lie to you he's a liar from the beginning please give your life to jesus it will do you good on this earth you will enjoy it when you finish on this earth go to heaven spend the everlasting spend eternity with father god joy 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 you will you will you will have the opportunity now you will see god face to face how it looks like the maker of heaven and earth, you will see him. The maker, you will see him face to face. You will talk to him face to face, you know. You will be there seeing the whole holy angels in the heaven. All the saints, you will see them. You see everything in the heaven. The, the, the street of God, you will walk on the street of God. Please give him. He worth everything for you giving your life to Jesus. He worth everything. No suffer, no suffering. You know, be, you don't have to pay for be anymore. You don't have to labor anymore. You just enter into your rest. Angels are there to help you out the sense. Please give your life to Jesus. He's, he wants everything for you giving your life to Jesus. He loves you. He cherishes you. He's with you right now knocking at your door saying, My daughter, my son, open up to me. I just want to come in and live with you. He's the Prince of Peace. He wants his peace to reign in your life. Please don't, don't reject this offer. As he, hears, as he has heard you, please give him your life. Please give him your life wherever you are. I invite you, please, give your life to Jesus. Give your life to Jesus. He loves you. Give your life to him. He doesn't want sin to, to, to rule, over, rule, 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 rule over your life and reign over your life. No. 
of you doing what you are doing, you are in addition for, I mean, you have a bad habit addict to something that is not good for years, you are fighting with your own strength to give up on that addition you couldn't able to do it why? because you don't have the power on your own you cannot fight the devil the enemy by your own strength it's only Jesus that can fight for you it's only Jesus that defeated the enemy and he still defeated him. If you surrender to Jesus, give your life to Jesus, it will set you free. For that struggle of that addiction, that bad habit, it will set you free. Who the Son of God set free is free. Just give your life to Jesus. He loves you. He loves you so much. May the Lord bless you. He loves you. As I will pray the prayer of salvation, please pray it from, the, from your whole heart. Mean it from your whole heart. It will do you good. It will do you good. Please, it will do you good on this earth. It will do you good when you close on, close your eye in that. It will do you good from a fallacy to a fallacy. You will enjoy it in Jesus' name. Please pray this and pray this uh, prayer of salvation after me in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Let us pray. Dear God, I am a sinner. I need forgiveness. I believe that Jesus Christ died. I believe that Jesus Christ died for my sin. I believe that Jesus Christ died for my sin. He shed his precious blood for me, died for my sin. I am willing to turn from sin. I now invited Jesus Christ to come into my heart as my personal Savior. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I'm happy for you. I'm happy for you. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord keep you. May the Lord let his face shine upon you. May the Lord hold you no, on his lovely palms, on his lovely hands, till you will see him face to face in Jesus. I welcome you in the body of Christ. May the Lord bless you. The angels of the Lord, they are rejoicing and right now because of you. Your name is written in the book of life right now. The Holy, Holy Spirit of God dwells in you, lives in you right now in the name of Jesus. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you in Jesus' name. Please, my sisters, my brother, wherever you are that receive Jesus, that accept Jesus Christ as your Lord or Savior, please buy a holy Bible, be reading the word of the Lord. By the grace of God, by the Holy Spirit that lives in you right now, dwells in you, it will start teaching you in the name of all of us. We are great in grace in the name of Jesus Christ. Please, please, please look for a Bible church, the church that teach on the undiluted word of God. They will teach you the word of God. The sound doctrine. They will not. They will not. They, they, they won't lie to you. They will teach you. They will teach you exactly what you want. To, what God said in His Word. In the name of Jesus, Christ. by the by the help of the Holy Spirit in Jesus' name. Please, I pray God lead your children to the right church, Almighty God, that they will hear the sound doctrine in the name of Jesus Christ for them to continue holding unto you till you will come attain them home in Jesus' name. Amen. And I thank God for your life in the name of Jesus Christ. Please, no, tell your pastors. You wanted them to make water baptism for you because Lord Jesus Christ did. He baptized and He told us to do the same. Then your pastors said that you want them to make water baptism for you. I pray that we have the time to to make that water baptism for you in the name of Jesus. Christ. remain blessed in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. I'm happy for you. I welcome you once again in the body of Christ in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen and amen. Oh, my. <laughs> Virtuous women, what why may the Lord bless you, bless you, bless you, bless you, bless you. Virtuous women, what why in the east, in the west, in the north, in the south. May the Lord bless all of us in the name of Jesus Christ. Virtuous women, oh, you are so, you are so precious to Jesus. You are so precious. If you can see that the, the Lord Jesus Christ says the joy, the joy that you are bringing to His heart, the joy, the joy, the laughter, oh, smile every day when He sees you. Virtuous women, wherever you are. Jesus rejoice over you. Jesus is thanking. Jesus is thanking God for letting you know He is your God. For you standing holiness and righteousness is by Him by the grace of God. We thank God for God. I thank God for all of you. Now I'm rejoicing. One day, all of us will meet in heaven. We will see each other by the grace of God in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Jesus loves you so much. Jesus loves you. Jesus, please. Jesus Christ, I rely on Lord. He rely on us for us going. 
women out there telling the 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 on the, the, the dying world, telling them about Jesus and advertise Jesus to them, evangelizing Jesus to them, lifting Jesus up. Jesus will draw then his children back to him in the name, draw men back to him in the name of Jesus. Come, virtuous women, Jesus is proud of you. Virtuous women, Jesus is proud of you. Continue, continue carrying that sin that longer be throwing it. Jesus love you, my sister. Jesus love you, my brother. Give your life to Jesus. Jesus Christ is coming in the gate. Come, give your life to Jesus. Please, he wants you to spend eternity with him. Let us continue telling them Jesus love them. Let us continue train that seed of love. Let us continue in the name of Jesus. We reward you greatly in the name of Jesus Christ. Virtuous women. Please, virtuous women, please don't say somebody tell you that a woman should not preach. You have to close your mouth. Please don't do that. Please don't let the enemy see blessing of a winning soul from you. Please don't let them see it. Jesus Christ said in his word. He said, he said on all, we should go to all nations and win water and preach his word and preach his word. He didn't say only men go. He said, oh, all of us should go. We are disciples of, men are disciples of Jesus. Women are disciples of Jesus. Dorcas, he was a disciple of God, a disciples of God. If Dorcas can be in the disciples of God, we will virtuous women, all the women, we are we are disciples of God as well. If Dorcas was a, was a woman, she said she was one of the disciples of God. We bless the name of the Lord. We should not let the enemy lie to us. Not to, the, the Samaritan woman went out uh, and evangelized Jesus uh, to his uh, to his uh, city, and the city was saved. And the city, the men in the city was saved. And the Lord in the they, 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 they were saved. All of them that came, they believe in Jesus. Uh, Jesus is the sub that the, 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 the Samaritan woman not to preach him, not to tell people about him. Don't listen to those counterfeit pretend that say women should not preach. Please don't listen to them. They want to see your blessing. They are from, uh, they, they, they are antichrist. Uh, what is it called? The counterfeit preachers. Uh, please don't listen to them. If those men that are telling you women should not preach, uh, if they fall into the pit, uh, if woman is coming to come and rescue them into it from that, in that pit, uh, they will not say, woman, because you are a woman, don't rescue me from the pit. Uh, they will be so happy that somebody can, came to, to rescue them. In the rescue them. In the, the dying soul, then one that doesn't know Jesus, where are they? They are in the pit, the spiritual pit. You and I, if we go down there and I tell them about Jesus, we have rescued them from the pit of hell. In the name of Jesus, I don't let somebody tell you, you are a woman, you cannot preach. Oh, that is life from the bottom of the hell. Jesus Christ didn't stop the Samaritan woman, the Samaritan woman, not to preach his word, not to tell people about him. And the people were saved because of that woman. To go out there, woman, go out there. With daughters of Zion, go out and evangelize to G. Evangelize Jesus to his children. Let the children of God be saved. Let them come out of that pit of darkness and come and live for Jesus. In the name of Jesus, may the Lord bless all of us in Jesus. Name. God will reward you greatly. All the women worldwide, God will reward you. Continue winning so for Jesus. On that day, God will reward you. We will, we will see that reward. That said that the, he said that the word of the Lord said that one that wins souls, they are wise. So you will see how God will reward you greatly on that day in Jesus. Name. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord let his face shine upon you in Jesus' name. Amen. Virtuous women, I am really happy. I'm rejoicing over, over all of us. We are just rejoicing. One day we will see each other. One day, not so long, not so long. Ah, we will see, Je we will see Lord Jesus Christ come. Maybe comes today, maybe comes today. We don't know that day. And that day we will just um, pump, pump, pump. All of us are just flying up to the sky. Just go and meet our Lord Jesus Christ. We will, from there we start rejoicing, hugging each other. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. My sister, you are made. My brothers, you are made. You know, a, what a joy that day will be for all the sons of the daughter of God to see each other in heaven. A joy, 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 joy that day. Amen. We are looking forward to that day in Jesus' name. Amen. My sisters, my brothers, my mommies, my daddies, wherever you are, please. I want you, if you have a book pen, please get a, a piece of paper. I want to call uh, some scriptures to you. Please, in your quiet time, if you have, when you have time, please read it for yourself. This is the word of the Lord. Praise Master Jesus. Please, if you want to, if you want to test it, just send it by text or by, by WhatsApp or Facebook. Anyone you want to do, just send it to the children of God. May the Lord bless you. In Jesus' name, amen. I call the scriptures, uh, Psalms, the book of Psalms. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. The book of Psalms, 135 verse 15. 
the book of uh, as, the book of uh, Deuteronomy seven twenty five to twenty six. The book of Isaiah thirty two thirty verse twenty two. The book of Isaiah chapter thirty one verse seven. The book of Deuteronomy twenty two verse five. The book of uh, Jeremiah four thirty. The book of 2 Kings 9.30. The book of Ezekiel 29.40. The book of uh, the, the book of Revelation 21 verse 8. The book of uh, uh, T verse 15. The book of praise master Jesus. Hallelujah to the Lamb of God. The book, the book of uh, First Corinthians, chapter eleven, verse uh, five to six. May the Lord bless you. It is my prayer when you will read it. May the Lord give you understanding of His word, and may the Lord give you the grace to obey Him in Jesus' name. To obey His word in Jesus' name. Amen. Pray, pray, uh, praise Master Jesus. My my mommies, my daddy, and my mommies, my 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 sisters, wherever you are, if you are still packing the Jezebel property on your body, please stop it. Don't let a Jezebel property take you away from heaven. Don't let Jezebel property see heaven from you. All those uh, jewelries, all those uh, jewelries you are packing on your body, jewelry here, ring, uh, ring, 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 ring. Please don't let them take you away from the heaven. Hellfire is not your portion. Hellfire is not our portion to go. Please don't disobey God. As God said, it's an abomination to him for you and I to put on gold and silver on our, on our body. We should not even bring it to our house. We should detest them. It's in the word of God. As I've given you those scriptures, read them for yourself. You will understand what God is telling you. As God said, we should dress modestly as a woman. Please stop dressing, putting on trousers as a woman. Please stop it. Dress modesty with trousers is for men. You can so go to the public toilet. You will see that is the the sign that they kept there. The sign that kept there. You know that this is the tradition is for the men. You will see it there the women the dress. So please dress modesty. When you dress, don't be carried. You you half your breast is coming out. Please dress modesty. Dress modesty. Please help our brothers out there. Please help them not to be not to be committing adultery in their hearts. By you dressing the sexy dress, uh, chest open, half breast, uh, half breast uh, out, half breast, uh, breast out on the, on the on the armpit or this side, you know all this in the back, you know. Please stop it. Dress modestly when you are going for interview, women. You dress well. You dress very good. Why, when you are going out to the, when you are coming to the church, you dress uh, half naked, or you said you dress a uh, uh, clothes dress, but to uh, see through everything you can see through the neck, can see through everyone, and see you can see through what you are, what you put on. Please stop it, glorify Almighty God, glorify Him, let Him see you as a daughter of Zion, daughter of Sarah. Please, please don't be dressing. Uh, Dressing half naked, dress properly. You are a daughter of Zion. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord bless you. Don't let or the, don't let disobedience take you away from the from the hand of God to from heaven. Please, Jesus cherish you. Please stop packing up all those Jezebel property. The perfume, don't put it, don't be spraying. But you are lying. Packing up makeup on your face, face you changing your color or the bleaching your skin. You are a liar. Putting on wig, putting on wig on attachment wool, or using it to make your hair as a woman, you are a liar. And not only lying, you are defying your hair. As a woman, our hair is our glory. The moment you are putting all those, uh, all those, uh, all those, uh, the what is it called? All those uh, attachment, the uh, wig, uh, and the uh, wig on, all this, this fishing, you don't know. They even, the one that's selling it, they have already, uh, they, they have already uh, dedicated it to the, to the idol. You don't know the persons who you are wearing their hair. Don't know if that person was a witch. It was a witch or there was a witch. You don't know. You don't know if that person was in their occult. You don't know everything that belongs to that person. That the only thing that the, that those spirit is in those things. Please stop wearing them. Stop it. Your hair is your glory. Maintain your glory. Cover your hair when you are in the presence of God as a woman. Cover your hair. Cover your hair. Your hair is your glory. Honor your hair. Honor God. May the Lord bless you. Cover your head.
Cover your hand. May the Lord bless God. We reward you. Anything that you gave up for Jesus on this earth, he will reward you greatly. Our brothers out there, please, that are meditating, all those ones that are weaving their hair, weaving, putting a earring, a pier, piercing their eye, poke, packing tattoo on their body, sagging their, 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 trousers, their trousers. Please stop it. You are might of men and might of God. Please stop it. Don't be putting all those rubbish. Please cut your hair nicely. Please cut your hair nicely. Don't let those worldly things uh, take you away from God. The Father's God said in His Word, "If you are a, if you are a friend of the Word, you are enemy of Him." Please don't don't be, don't be enemy of God. Be a friend of God. Lord, create you. Father God, create you from His own image. Please give your life to Jesus. As you love Jesus. Show him how much you love him by you obey him by you giving up all those Jezebel property by you honoring him obey him dress modestly as a as a woman men dread decently in the name of Jesus may the Lord bless you may the Lord bless all of us may the Lord give all of us the grace to obey him to be an obedient children of God Amen Hallelujah to them to the Lamb of God I bless the Lord I bless God for God please let us stop lying all liars all liars the word of the Lord say all liars where they shall end their life all liars all liars shall they have their part in the lake which a born with a fire and bristle that will not be your portion that will not be my portion we should stop lying we should stop lying anyone that still found themselves in life has God for mercy I ask God to help you to deliver you from that spirit of lies and he will deliver you there is nothing that I have for God to do greater is he that is in us than he that is in the world we deliver you in Jesus name may the Lord bless you remain blessed remain blessed then we see you again by the grace of God in Jesus name amen shalom 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 amen Hallelujah on the logo do mini potent training.